Well, you know, Adam, we're based in San Francisco doing a show about myths. So obviously we have to tackle the myth about the escape from Alcatraz. That uh, three prisoners in 1962 built a raft out of raincoats and got off the island? Yeah. Did they actually do it? Was it successful? Where did they go? The Bay Model was built in the mid-50s to test the environmental impact of a proposed development in San Francisco Bay. It's a perfect scale model covering two acres and replicates a full day's tidal movements in just under 15 minutes. The guys know the high tide had just turned when the escapees hit the water. I'll just wait for the signal. Oh, we're good. Drop it. Nicely done. Remember, the myth says Morris and the Anglins were heading north to Angel Island. The current tells a different story. The raft is heading west in a hurry. <laughs> we're escaping Alcatraz at Mach 1. No wonder they didn't find them. They're probably in Japan by now. The raft was never found, but according to FBI intelligence, it was made of three pontoons. It was 14 feet long and six wide. To make sure the raft is airtight, each seam needs to be glued, dried, and compressed together. The real escapees did this in the dark and silently. Wait, was that a guard? <laughs> no. Hey. <laughs> It took 30 raincoats, but the Mythbusters have their raft. They're ready to use it to escape the rock. Based on the information that we have, uh, I think the raft is very similar to what they had on Alcatraz. I give us a 60% chance of making it, 20% chance of immediate catastrophic failure, <laughs> and 20% slow descent into the depths of hell. The FBI files say the escapees were aiming for Angel Island, but the Mythbusters will test their own theory, that they were smart enough to use the outgoing tide to carry them to the Marin headlands. Of course, there were three in the real escape attempt, so young Will Abbott has been drafted from the workshop to be their partner in crime. Got it? Got it. Go, Jamie, it's all you, buddy. Oh, Jamie, you the man, baby. <laughs> the rafts passed its first test. It's holding Jamie's weight. Here I go, Jamie. OK, we're off. Three. Here we are. We're escaping. <laughs> Adam, Jamie, and Will are paddling across the tide. If they've miscalculated, the current will sweep them under the Golden Gate Bridge and out to sea. The raft is getting weaker. Every 10 minutes, they have to add more air. And the tidal rip is getting rougher. It's so cool! It seemed impossible, but the Mythbusters are almost there paddling a raincoat raft more than three miles across a rushing tide, making landfall just east of the Golden Gate Bridge. <laughs> we made it! Given a reasonable amount of intelligence, I think it's entirely possible that they made it. Again, I think the most damning evidence that they didn't is the fact that no one's heard from them since. Unless they find any specific evidence that these guys, you know, lived happily ever after or something after they got ashore, uh, you know, we won't know whether it was true or not, but uh, we know that it could have been done, which is cool. Here's something to ponder, though. The tide carried an oar to Angel Island. That tide came directly from the Marin headlands. How did the oar get there, if not with the escapees? The mystery remains. I'm king of the world! 